Yo, what's up guys uh, um, how are you guys doing um, welcome back again to the flow this is pedro um, let's go straight to the chat um, um okay so um our analysis last week was to look for a buy signal right look for a buy signal from here so one two one two three four five so we wanted to find buys from here all right so we had our buys Okay, I'm going to four hour now. We had our buys. Okay, that, that is from here. Okay, even the buys started the previous um, um, the previous week, right? So we have our buys from here, and definitely you should make something out of that that area right now. How many pips was that? I'm gonna get straight to that level, right? Um. Let me see. Let's see if you start to buy from here to here, you're going to make 365 pip. That's enough. That's a lot. So if you have your pip or you have your target, or as we were always expecting price to go upwards, what's the next thing to look at? You look at swings, right? So definitely you could see that price change direction. You'll be out of the game and you wait for price to give you a setup again. Right, so since there's no setup, what do we do? We wait, okay? How we expected price to go, price didn't go further. At least it gave you that push and you could have, I'm sure you would have protected your entry. So when price turned around, you'll still be safe. You get me? So um, um, uh, price is bearish, right? Let me go into daily now. We had our rejection point giving us equal low, right? The equal low could have been qualified when price broke this high. Okay, so you could see that since that didn't happen, price has to keep dropping. All right, it's possible it has decided to come to look for this equal lows over here. All right, but I'm suspecting price testing this area. All right, when it tests it and it doesn't go further, okay, it tests this area, it doesn't go further. Maybe to give us our buy signal that we've been waiting for a long time now. Okay, so um, this is what's happening. It's out of some fundamentals in uh, the U.S. economy. Okay, so um, let's see what what pops up. If it still wants to give us what it's given us, then it's possible we are going to get more buys after this drop. Okay, price coming to clear this low, then we might get a way of going bullish the more, right? In a way, okay. So if we go bullish the more as possible in future we can just drop it okay so um this is what i think for gold um protect your trades and don't be greedy if you are not greedy you'll be safe in any trade no matter what the market gives you right thank you so much and uh, enjoy your day bye